Alright guys, so here's the thing. Right now it is Tuesday, October 12th. When you're seeing this, it's gonna be the 25th. That's almost two weeks from now. I got an invite from DeWalt to come up to Baltimore to check out what they're calling the next generation of cordless power tools. I'm gonna bring you guys along so you can see what the trip is like. It's time to go. And just like that, welcome to the beautiful, welcome to Baltimore. But now we're here, we're gonna check it out, see what the walls calling their next generation of tools. I can't wait to see it. I hope you can't. So come along. Okay, stop right there. It's obviously not the 25th when you're seeing this. Originally when DeWalt had invited all of us to this, they put a, an embargo on all of the information related to this event and the release. So we were not allowed to talk about it until the 25th. assume you're a residential contractor. Now you probably have tons of compact batteries because they use with you know tools like impact drivers all day long. But if you ever try to use one of those compact batteries with something like a Cirque Saw to cut this OSD, you might find that the performance comes up a little bit short. So first I'm going to demonstrate with the Milwaukee using a compact battery. And I'll just make a couple cuts here. All right, let's look at the batteries real quick, guys. Check the batteries on here. Cool. Cool, cool. Two amp hour CP and uh, 1.7 power stack. Okay. Three holes. So one, two, three, go. Ready? Three holes and one, two, three, go. You guys ready? Yep. One, two, three, go. Yeah, that's going faster. You switch? Yep. Yep. Let's do that again. One, two, three, go. Yep, you found out. So as you were saying, so uh, with the cylindrical cells, uh, you essentially you take the materials and you roll them up into into a uh, cylinder. With the pouch cells, they're laid flat, uh, and it allows it to run cool. Okay. So that it's better heat dissipation, which gives it, uh, as Frank told you in that room before, that the two X life versus a cylindrical cell, and it also allows for better performance. Better performance. Okay. So in a demanding constant use situation you're less likely to run into like a, a thermal shutdown from the battery correct correct okay and and it, it's a lower impedance uh, okay pack essentially correct and so how is it that these achieve versus the cylindrical cells uh the capability of more charge cycles well it's it's through the the less heat and better heat dissipation right because okay. we know heat is what kills these things yeah. right so the fact that it's not rolled up into one you know if you think of the center of of that cylindrical cell it's very hot it's different temperature from what's on the outside of that cell so the the configuration of these being flat and stacked allows for better heat dissipation that's what really gives it the okay life. it's the so i want to show you a couple of our brand new impact drivers that we just launched. Um, what I want to specifically, can you still hear me? So what I want to specifically talk about is the 
talk about is the advantage that this power stack compact battery is going to deliver in impact drive. So we talked about 50% more power, 25% more compact, also 12% more lightweight. So very ideal for a tool that's going to be in your hands all day and that you're going to fit into tighter space. Okay? So first, we have our DCF 840. This is our brand new single speed uh, brushless impact driver. So what I'm going to show you first is the same tool with our current 20 volt 2 amp hour battery and then our 20 volt power stack compact battery. We're gonna run these head to head on eight inch structural screws into a double stack four by four. You should see, based off lab tests, about an 18% difference going to the power stack. I'm gonna check the battery level. So that's full. 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 Again, you should see about an 18% difference. Mm -hmm. It was definitely ahead there. <laughs> you get the point there. All right, so how does that equate to the competition? So here's the Milwaukee single speed. Okay, so using their 18 volt 2 amp hour, going to our upgraded DCF 840, but also the upgrade in the power stack compact battery, you should see about a 48% difference in the speed of app in this 8 inch structural screw demo. Let's see if I can make sure I don't fall off of it here. One more time. So beyond just the 48% difference going to power stack in this particular application, you're also going to get 50% more screws done off a of single charge. So in this case, in this application, we're actually getting more run time. Okay? So that's performance. So tool to tool, we're getting 18% more performance. And then against the competition, 48% faster in that application. So let's talk, talk, let's talk about ergonomics as well. Because in this case, it's probably the, the uh, more important factor in impact drivers. So this is the new atomic three-speed impact driver. So this is our highest torque impact driver, but also our most compact, or shortest. At under four inches in length, it makes it the shortest in the entire market. To pair that with a power stack compact battery, this makes it ideal for fitting into those tight spaces like cabinetry, the nine-inch cabinet. You think about like a spade bit, getting between framing, where you can't, you don't want to grab a, a drill, you want to grab the impact driver because of that tight space. Well, sometimes the impact driver doesn't even fit, you gotta grab another tool. So the, the extra inch and a half that we got on this tool makes a big, big difference. We also figure in like ergonomics, lightweight, just the fact that this tool is in your hand all day long. You're using it in overhead applications, reduce user fatigue, um, but also when it's on your belt, right? It's more compact, lighter weight. So you add it all up with this battery, we're getting 50% more power, 25% more compact, 15% lighter weight, double double the life of the cells, right? Uh, which will make all the difference in impact drivers. So across the impact drivers, across the batteries themselves, taking it to the next level of performance, but also making it